a futuristic two-door coupe with skinny headlights, a bulky body, and a broad stance may have appeared to be going to land on an odd-looking UFO to casual viewers at the Japan Mobility Show. Actually, Subaru made the decision to introduce two cars at the show one for the road and the other for the air. Introducing the principles of air mobility and sport mobility. For the record, Subaru does not refer to the SVX from the 1990s while discussing the sport mobility concept, although there are uncanny parallels. Both are large coupes with two doors and slender headlamps. There's something curiously odd about them both. Furthermore, none seems to neatly fall into one particular car category. The sport mobility concept, for instance, has a strange toughness that kind of fits the criteria even if it doesn't ride as high as a traditional crossover. Is this a genuine coupe? Does it only pass over? Does it have anything to do with takeoff and the air mobility concept? That final query has a negative response. Together, these two ideas were put forth since they each stand for more freedom in mobility. Accordingly, the sport mobility concept is advertised as a fun battery electric vehicle that can be driven anywhere, anytime, and in any kind of weather. Regretfully, Subaru provides no information regarding the precise mode of transportation for the concept. However, we are informed that it has a low driving position and a seat located in the middle of the cockpit for a comfortable driving experience.